You see it displayed on your coins and your cash. And now the phrase, in God we trust, is being placed on a few county buildings in McDowell County. Not everyone is backing that change. News 13's Justin Hinton joins us live from Marion. And Justin, commissioners are already planning to put up signs to let people know which building is a county administration building. The chairman says it was really perfect timing. The county commissioner's seats are empty, and the decision has been made unanimously. In God We Trust will go up on the McDowell County Administration Building. We just want to reaffirm what our founding forefathers affirm, that uh, In God We Trust. Chairman of the board, David Walker, says the only difference in this drawing, the text will all be the same size. I love it. You can put it on any ever building in town if you'd like to. Oh, that's who I trust is the Lord. Well, maybe not every building, but the motto is planned for two more locations. One inside the admin building's boardroom where the commissioners meet. We want to be attractive and, and, and nice and, and blend in with our current decor of the boardroom. The other at the courthouse. It's good that we are going to walk past buildings and be reminded that we can trust in him and everything will be okay. But not everyone thinks the message should be displayed right here on the county building let alone at all. There's supposed to be a uh, separation of church and state. I don't think it should be put on a public building. It shouldn't be changed just, just because someone believes a certain way, because there are tons of people here that don't believe the same way. Not saying that I don't, but just saying that there's still people out there that, that don't, and we should be respectful of them as well. We understand that not everybody uh, would uh, be in favor of that decision. And that's what makes America great. Uh, they can protest, they can uh, file an appeal, they can take whatever action they feel like they need to take. But I would say this, I think we're on pretty solid ground here with, with the court, court cases uh, and courts, the ruling that the court has already given out. Now, no taxpayer dollars will go into the purchase of the lettering or the installation. Now, as far as upkeep, the chairman says that if there is a cost, he imagines that it would be small. Reporting live in Marion, Justin Hinton, News 13.